Welcome back, Rads Up 44 here on Nalio Gaming, checking out Pixel Heroes, Bite, and Magic on the PlayStation 4. Pixel Heroes is by The Bit Father and Head Up Games. We're jumping right in. Alright, we have new game options, Graveyard, Achievements, and Credits. New game it is. Choose a campaign for your adventure. Campaign 1, Hard Fools of Radiance. Campaign 2, Brutal. Finish Campaign 1 first. Okay, so I gotta do the hard one first. Welcome to the tavern. Some brave heroes have found their way to, to these far reaches, seeking treasures and glory. Hire three heroes for your epic adventure. Where am I? Oh, I'm just point and clicking. All right. I'm not actually on the screen right now. So, let's see. Losing my temper. Oh, she looks like a badass. Hack, Hackmanite? The Skyborn Ronin. Growing up, she had... To chop wood for three hours a day, so she's tough. She prayed for rain yesterday. It rained. Okay. Faith. She loves uh, dirty mountains. She gets cranky if she doesn't get her a daily burnt pork tenderloin. <laughs> Alright, so... Let's see. Let's hire her. I smell a treasure. A band. What is this? May what a man cave. Uh, Rondra human war warrioress. Oh, it's a chick or a girl. I'm sorry. It's a female character. Not digging her. Her favorite childhood game was rock smashing. Uh, let's see, what's this person? Dalbin human war mage. At birth. He was so strong, his parents had to build a stone crypt. Yeah, let's go with him. <laughs> he was, that's funny. We need one more. What's this? Garth. As a child, he claimed he could talk to spirits. Last week, he won a boulder a stacking contest. He prides himself on his collection of pink torches. He believes money is a furry goat conspiracy okay never mind I'm the hero of mopping up this place stinks smashing let's see grimly a practice cat throwing all right you know what let's just go with him that's mean that he threw cats but let's check it out All right, we got our three heroes. Listen, the end is the end is nigh. Hear my words and prepare. An ancient cult has set foot in our lands. They call themselves the the sun. <laughs> they call themselves the Sons of Dawn and pray to some dark elder being. They have started recruiting people for their cause all over the country. I fear that they want to try to awaken something which should be left sleeping. Something dangerous and sinister. Something that might destroy us all. Spend your last, uh, spend your last of days wisely. We will meet again once the time has come for your final quest. Casino, bank casino, mumble mumble bars. All right, we should prepare. A simple silver veined devil's reef. 
Would you please hear me out? I am desperate for help, and you seem able. I'm looking for clues to the whereabouts of my husband. He's been gone for over a year now, and I am all alone with our kids and the farm. I heard he came through here some time ago, but I never saw him. Could you look for anything that belongs to him, like our wedding ring? It's a simple silver band engraved with my name. Anthea, would you be so kind to look for it? Sure. Alright, you have a new quest. A silver, uh, simple silver band. Sweet. My beard itches. Are you interested in sharp and pointy things? You've come to the right place. I buy my raw materials mostly from adventurers. Okay. Look at this dude over here in the cape. What's up with him? The mighty dude. Miyamoto and Sakaguchi! Exclamation sell out. Can we interest you in a state of the art magically floating exclamation marks? What, you are heroes? No, we only sell our exclamation marks to desperate citizens. Okay, well, that's kind of stupid. We are on an adventure. You see a dog sitting on the side of the road. She has a friendly look on her face and looks eager to show you something. Woof. Bark. Follow the dog. Pet the dog. Throw a stick. Ignore it. Your heroes start following the dog into a nearby forest where she begins digging under a tree. There's nothing there. The dog looks happy though and starts peeing in the hole. It looks like you're done here. Do you want to take a rest and review your inventory? Continue travel, open inventory. Alright, what do we got? What the heck? Idol of Ingenuity. There is a bizarre idol standing on the side of the road. Two faces appear to be floating in front of it. We have a fine riddle for you. It's your, if you answer correctly, we will bestow great wis wisdom upon you. There is a house. One enters it blind and comes out seeing. What is it? <clears throat> Excuse me. Enters blind, comes out seeing. There's a house. When it enters blind, it comes out seeing. What? How is that wrong? Stand your ground. Oh, we got something gonna come at us, huh? Mediocre sword of boredom.
Okay. First blood, defeat your first enemy. First blood, bronze PlayStation trophy. You hit like a halfling. Okay, so there's plenty to, there's plenty to do and there's a lot involved. It looks a little overwhelming, but I think once you understand the menus, it, it'll be just fine. Unknown creature, you see a dull, dark, tall silhouette standing on the side of the road. It seems to be looking straight into your hero's eyes. Stare back, attack, ignore it. Your heroes just walk past the dark silhouette. Do you want to take a rest and review your inventory? Continue. Heals 40% of your health. Heals 80%. Bracing Charm of Wind. Strength plus 4. Defense 25%. Nurturing Belt of Health. Inspiring Necklet of Warrior. Oh, okay, cool. We can put it on. That's awesome. That is cool. What is this? Is this this? No, that's not that. Plus three. All right, those are all the same. What is this though? Okay, I think we're good. I like this. Instead of a cursor, though, I wonder... <clears throat> Excuse me. I wonder if I can change it to... Let's 
Let's see. Oh, that's not what I wanted. There, okay. Snapping controls. Precursor. That's what I wanted. Okay, that's what I wanted. I wanted to be able to, instead of using the cursor, just much better. Well now, you are in loot. Book of Shelter, Hardening Charm, Healing. Hold X and, oh yeah, we already know that. Okay. You can change, you can change battle positions. Yes, you can. Where does this go? Oh, it does go there. Okay, cool. There we go. Okay. Die, you will all die.
Oh boy. Um. Oh boy. How do I heal this one? Wow, I got lucky there. I got really lucky there. Good thing I figured out what a magic missile was. Oh, I got some nice loot. I need to use a healing potion. Okay. Sweet. So that's how you delete it. You just bring it down to the bottom left. Alright, I know I said the last one was going to be the last fight, but this is going to be the last fight.
Ooh, that was some nice damage. Yes. Coming right down to the wire almost every time with at least one character. Alright, we got a couple things. Maybe I'll upgrade. Maybe I'll uh, have something that'll make one of my characters more powerful. The heroes have reached the next level. Now you can add points to the attributes. Okay. All right, so we're up to Devil's Reeve level four. So that's where I'm going to end my first gameplay with Pixel Heroes Bite and Magic by the Bitfather and Head Up Games here on the PlayStation 4. I appreciate you watching on Nelio Gaming. If you haven't already done so, please click that like button. Let me know in the comment section what you think. Share with your friends. Follow me on Twitter at RiseUp44 and at Nelio Gaming. And subscribe to me here on Nelio Gaming. So it's it's a fun game. I like that you can, you know, you, you're with a group and you're fighting together. You get all this loot if you survive. And then you can just put it on any character. It doesn't go with a certain type of character. It just it fits on whoever you want to upgrade. That's pretty cool. So I'm definitely interested to see what happens moving forward. Let me know in the comment section what you guys think, and I'll see you next time.